Amanil Kumar sharing with you test questions on sine and cosine functions. The question here is how to write cosine equation as a sine function. We are given two cosine equations here. We have 2 cos 5 plus 30 degrees. We need to write this as a sine function. The other one is minus 2 over 3 cos of half 5 minus 20 degrees plus 3 equals to sine of what? To write sine, to write cosine as sine, what we need to do is to add quarter of the cycle. That is what we need to do. To add quarter of cycle. In that case, the cosine becomes sine. So let's first find the time period and then we'll find one fourth of the time period. Add that up to write down the cosine function. For the very first one, 2 cos 5 plus 30, what is the time period? In this case, time period is 360 degrees. And quarter of this time period is quarter of or one fourth of 360 degrees, which is 90 degrees. So to write cos 2, 5 plus 30 degrees in sine, we could write this as amplitude remains same, which is 2, and then we have sine 5 plus 30. Add this quarter of the time period which is 90 right so you get your answer which is 2 sine phi plus 120 degrees right so that is how you could actually change a cosine equation into a sine function in the second one it is minus 2 over 3 cos of half phi minus 20 in degrees plus 3 equals to sine of what? Well, the amplitude and the vertical translations remain the same, right? However, we have to add quarter of this time period. Now, what is the quarter of this time period? Let me rewrite the cosine equation as minus 2 over 3 cos. Let's take this half common. So we get 5 minus 20 plus 3. Now this half, that means time period, is equals to 360 degrees divided by half, which is 720 degrees, and one fourth of 720 is half is 360 and half is 180 degrees. One fourth is 180 degrees. We have to add this up. So what we can do here is we can write this as a sine function as amplitude remains same. There is no change. There is only change in the phase shift. So it becomes half phi minus 20 plus this quarter of this time period. Vertical translation will also remain same. So this could be written as minus 2 over 3 sine half. So if you take away 20 from 180, you get 160 degrees, right degrees here, okay, plus 3. So that is how you could write the given cosine as sine function. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.